So I'm already testing out some of the, the things on this camera. Guys, 5D Mark IV is amazing. Cute, like right? Uh-oh, we got another gift. Maybe we can reserve these for later. It's your backpack. Right there. All right, come on, let's go. Over here with mommy. Ari, look, you got another present. Oh my gosh, you got another present. This is your present. Let's open it. Let's open it and let's see what's inside. So, yeah. Uh, 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 Ari. We got a little baby doing some weird stuff. Hold on. Mm. I just before I took Look at this. There you go. Just throwing on the red outfit. Baby, are you mad? You look so cute. Can't go wrong without uh, with the Mariah. So we just getting it all, man. Getting it all on camera. This is I, this is phenomenal. This is a great Christmas day. Top of the morning, everybody. Uh, it's a new, new day. It's uh, day after Christmas, and it's time to get this cut going and, and get it going in a major way. So uh, I'm gonna get back onto my diet today. Make sure that I'm doing it correctly and, and the, the right amount of food with the right amount of water, um, and of course taking fat burn XL to peel this fat off my body. So. Um, I'm not fat, so that's a good thing, but uh, I need to be where I want to be, and, and that's uh, lean and, and cut. So today I'm starting this cut again, and I've already lost about 20, 20 pounds. I mean, actually, it's about 15 pounds, so um, I'm going to be getting better after today, alright? So make sure y'all follow this journey. All right. So, Christmas was a huge success. It was awesome for my family, uh, my beautiful baby girl, my wife, and it's awesome. It was awesome, great time. Uh, shared a lot of love, a lot of laughter. Wish I could be home in Dallas with my people, but you know, I got, got a family of my own now, and. Love him to death. Uh, miss my little boy Casey back in Houston, but I will be seeing him soon. Um, you know, it's just it's a little frustrating for me that topic, but um, like I said, the gym is my salvation for all that. You know, no matter good or bad or indifferent, whatever goes on in my life, it does not matter. Um, as far as the gym goes, that's where. It used to be football for me. It used to be playing quarterback where I can go out on the field and just, you know, just let all my frustrations go because I'm just gonna play the game. But now it's the gym. Good, bad, or indifferent. No matter what, <clears throat> the gym is my place. So, head to the other gym. As you can see, it's dark as hell out here. Five in the morning, time to get this work. No matter what, the work still persists. Gotta go get the work, man. So, I've been consistent doing cardio every day, right? And, and the cardio is never the issue. For me, I can do 45 minutes to an hour cardio a day. The difference is, is how you eat and it's what you put into your body. Um, the more consistent you can be with what you put into your body, the more consistent of a change you're going to see. You guys are going to find out and what you're going to see is the struggle that I have with my eating. Eating the same foods and it's the same struggle that everybody has, right? But um, that's where, you know, the discipline comes in. That's where you got to be, you got to be on your point, on your game. Every day I struggle with what I need to eat. Even though I know exactly how I need to eat every single day, it's just the struggle of doing it. And I see stuff and it just triggers, you know, 
Uh, oh, I want that, right? See a piece of chocolate, oh, I want that. Chips, oh, I want that. And my daughter, all she wants to eat is Doritos. Every day, that's all she wants to eat, Doritos, Funyuns, Cheetos. That's just my daily struggle, and I'm not gonna hide that, but I've gotta be strong, and I've gotta be consistent. And if I can do that, then that's where the body composition comes in, and that's how I'm gonna change, you know? I gotta overcome it, though. This is, this is, that's my fight, is the food. All right, about done, man. You know, 42 minutes in, here you go. Watch another YouTube channel. Uh, and get it in, man. All right, let's get this, get them weights. Woo, tired, bro. eventually will become irrelevant to you or you'll give 70% 80% but if you have a reason that's bigger than you why you're doing what you're doing then it'll drive you it'll drive you to get up it'll pull you out of bed right and then eventually once you get into it consistently then you can drive the thing that you are are um, the reason why you're doing what you're doing but you got it first have a reason why you're doing it because if you don't man you're just gonna give 70 percent 80 percent and you won't give your best and eventually uh you may get some you know some small changes in your body but it won't be what you're looking for like that that consistent change that you want so just you know words to the wise man get your why right and get your ass in the gym come up what are you doing why are you throwing stuff on the Hey. Where is it? There's a whole lot of cuteness. <laughs> Headed to the mall. It's gonna be crazy going back on that day after Christmas. Headed to the mall. Should be crowded going to Glendale Mall in Glendale, California. That shit gonna be crazy. So, here's where my struggle begins because mall food should be smelling good. Tell them I can't cook, can't control it, and I know I'm gonna be hungry. So, what do you do? Try to eat as healthy as you can. Y'all will see. It's tough. The struggle is real.
<laughs> oh shit, it worked. Okay, stop taking that. Okay, get ready to go. This shit's crazy. Wow, I never thought it would be this many people in the mall. But it is a lot. Okay, what up, what up? So, we are just finishing the edits for this video. Here we are. Thank you guys for watching. I got the little one in my lap. She she wants some stuff. I'm trying to get these bubbles going, so <laughs> gotta be a dad too, man, alright? So I appreciate you guys for watching. Talk to you guys later.